Hello, everybody, to the McDonald's Jewel Box and the McDonald's Jewel Unbox update for January of 2024. Happy New Year. Well, for those of you just checking in, never seen this before, what you are looking at is a McDonald's cheeseburger, a McDonald's apple pie, and a medium McDonald's fry. Now, this has been sealed within its own moisture, as you can see there from all the caulk, since May 31st, 2020. So, uh, this is what happens when it's just sealed within its own moisture. Now, this, as you can see right there, May 31st, 2022, uh, that's what happens to McDonald's food when it just sits out in the open air. So, sealed air, open air. It's just a fun science experiment that I've just been doing every month now. And um, we are going to do a bit of repairing of the McDonald's Jewel Box. This is the first time I have touched it repair-wise. There is some uh, crackage here, just stress cracks over time. From heat and then cold, uh, the plastic is bound to crack regardless of how great you do treat it. But we are going to patch these cracks up best we can in this video. The update from last month to this month is not too much of anything. As you see here, taking a look at the cheeseburger, what we have is still the same classic diarrhea, muddy, squashed down, nasty pancake from hell looking substance. I mean, this used to be a cheeseburger. You could tell right there, there's the cheese. Uh, it's now just a complete brown cow patty. The apple pie still looks about the same as last month. There really hasn't been much of any kind of change besides the fact of this white mold possibly getting a little bit smaller than before. The fries, they are about the same. As you can see, there's just a lot of fuzzy white mold and these black granules have collected on them. That is the most recent uh, development within the fries. But I am going to do a McDonald's jewel box first and show you guys the bottom of this thing. So here we go. That is the bottom of the McDonald's jewel box. It looks very, very nasty. You can see the wrapper that the cheeseburger is sitting on has turned into this, I don't know, it's just a, a moldy brown padding. Now, there has been one recent development. There is this white speck right here. It's on the inside of the case, so that has been the most latest development. I don't know if you could tell right here, it's not focusing, but there is uh, some mold spores or whatever just collecting the very top of this case. And taking a look at the McDonald's Jewel Unbox, I mean, here is the cheeseburger still in all of its glory. Completely just dry. Here is the apple pie. Uh, this feels actually pretty soft. I'm, I'm scared to try to press down on this. I don't want to break this. So I'll just set it right back. And the fries, I mean, they are pretty much just sticks. Yeah, this one was hanging out and chilling. There we go. All right, so in order to keep this as authentic as possible, we are going to start fixing some of these cracks here with the McDonald's jewel case. So what I'll be doing is taking some super glue, putting it on the end of this Q-tip, and going to town. Okay. 
you know, there's some people that have thought, you know, uh, you should stop doing this. Stop doing updates. Just throw this thing away by now. What are you, crazy? But I'm just like, you know, I, I've come this far. Why not just see it out? You know, go big or go home. So that's what we are doing. I did have to take this from the studio and store it in the basement uh, and only bring it up whenever I do these videos because I really do think from the cracks here that it was stinking a little bit like some of the air did seep out which isn't good and I think the moisture is still intact for the most part because it is still very, very wet. But just in case, I'm gonna make sure we get everything sealed up properly here. there we go the fixing of the jewel box is done and that is your update for january 2024 of the mcdonald's jewel box and the mcdonald's jewel unbox thank you guys for watching i will see you next month